Hello. In this video I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to share files and folders with other users on the computer or network. And I'm going to open Windows Explorer. And in the left pane under Libraries, if I were to expand Documents, there's two folders. There's a personal folder, which is my document, and then there's a public folder, which is public documents. And that goes the same with music, pictures, and video. You have your personal folder and then the public folder. And I'm going to show you something I like to do real quick. I'm going to remove all the public folders. I'll right click and click remove location from library. And once I have all the public folders deleted, I'm going to go to computer. I'm going to click on the C drive. I'm going to open users. And then I'm going to right click on the public folder and go to include in library and create new library. And here's the public library I just created. And within it are all the public folders, including public downloads and public recorded TV, which wasn't in the original set of libraries. And now I'm in John's account. And if I were to open Windows Explorer, Once again, under Libraries, if I were to expand Documents, there's a Personal folder and the Public folder. Now, if I were to click on Public Documents, there's a Shared folder. And if I were to switch users and go to Jane's account, she would have the Shared folder in her Public Documents also. And again, you don't have to delete the Public folders and create your own Public folder library if you don't want to. It's just something I like doing. And you can also set permissions for the folder by right-clicking and going to Properties. And then to Security. And here's where you could edit your permissions, change the permissions for each account. And that's a quick and easy way to share files and folders with other users on the computer or network. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.